yeah, it should be a good spot. Although, mosquitoes. First up. Oh my god. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the video. So we are already up out of the tent and Taylor is actually doing a little errand this morning. She's cruising off straight away with all that dirty washing. And there's a washing place just up the road here in Carpinteria. So we're at the state park and it's sort of just in the town as well. She's gonna go get everything clean because it's all getting pretty mag. Isn't your stuff pretty dirty? It all smells so bad. Yeah. <laughs> so she's gonna do that and I'm just gonna hang out here. Maybe check out the beach, go for a swim, do some sunbaking. <laughs> no, I'm gonna pack all that stuff up and then go beeline over there. So check it out, we bought this watermelon. It looks really nice. Hopefully it tastes as good as it looks. So this is the side guys. We've got the tent set up here under the tree and all that stuff's over on the table there. It was pretty busy last night. All right guys, we're gonna bounce out of this campground now. Everything's packed up, ready to go. I've got to work out where the hell Taylor is and get over there. So we're at the Carpinteria coin up laundry. Taylor's pretty much got everything done. She's gonna eat her half of the watermelon, which was epically nice by the way, really good. I'm gonna eat some leftover pasta and we're gonna try and get on the road. It's already pretty hot, guys. All right, so we're still hanging out in the laundromat here. Taylor's eating breakfast in here. And our panniers were full of ants, so we've also cleaned all the ants out of them. Beware of the ants over at that state park. And then we're gonna get on the road. Taylor, what are you doing? <laughs> all right, so we have clean clothes. They feel so weird, they smell good. And yeah, you know when you like get so used to wearing dirty clothes that you don't notice it? And then, or I mean, I should flip that around. You get so used to wearing clean clothes, you don't notice it. And then you have dirty clothes and it feels really gross. We were opposite. We were so used to dirty clothes that wearing the clean stuff, it's like, wow, this feels so different. This isn't, this isn't normal, you know? So anyway, I'm gonna cruise south. Apparently we got like 17 miles on the 101, which will be busy, but uh, I hear that it's like fenced off. So there's like a separate bike path. So that should be nice. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, so we made our way onto the path. You take the first exit straight off the 101. I missed it, I had to go back. But yeah, this, I mean, obviously it's a bit safer, you know. It's still noisy, but you get a better view of the beach as well. It's a good road for it, guys, a good bike path. Having it about 16 miles an hour with the tailwind, doing really well. So guys, even better than that bike path, we're now on Highway 1, which is basically dead because 101 runs right beside it. But at the moment, it's far enough away to not hear it. This is a surf beach though, so it's a little busier here. So we're still cruising here on Highway 1 and the 101's way above us now, which is really good. As you can see, the traffic's not so bad. There's a few cars here and there and a lot of RVs up on the beach. And back on the bike route. Ooh, people like to make noise with their cars here in the US. That's something I've noticed. Really annoying. I don't know if you guys have noticed, the US is a hella noisy place. It's hard to find peace and quiet here. Australia, Western Australia, completely different. You can find a quiet spot in the city. And this is all right. Hey guys, I can see the freeway up there on the left. I love it when you can't hear it. Then you just got the railway line and the beaches. The bike infrastructure, once you get to Santa Barbara or even north where the uni is, gets really nice, really enjoyable. Okay guys, we are in Ventura up on the beach. It's kind of, yeah, it's all right. We got here so fast, 17 miles and like smashed them out. And yeah, I think we're just gonna push on because we're both feeling good. It's only like 11 o'clock, we'll see. Restroom break. Luckily, we stumbled across these things. Sweet, restrooms. Okay, so we're just on the beach in Ventura, or just south of it. Guys, we smashed that 17 miles so easy. It's pretty close, we're pretty close to Oxnard too. So we're gonna kind of route ourselves to go right past the supermarket, pick up some food, and probably just push through the state park and have a late lunch there. Just had a Pacific Coast bike route sign. It's always a surprise to see them. They're in the most random of places. So check it out guys, this is the marina in Oxnard. We're just coming over the bridge here. We're making really good time. 
that must be the city back that way inland a bit okay so Taylor is finally back out of the supermarket check out all this food she got which was expensive 28 bucks got some of this vegan ice cream what is it cookies yeah cookies chocolate chip whatever mushrooms for the pasta some salsa for some more burritos got some low fat refried beans vegan avos tomatoes a lime some rice and some spaghetti guys can you believe that 28 dollars there the hell california is expensive isn't it taylor yeah i guess so <laughs> all right so we've just had like an emergency stop we realized we don't have uh, any new propane bottles and ours is like almost empty it might not even get another cook taylor's having a look to see if there's anywhere we tried this family dollar no good Hopefully there's somewhere on our route. Big fail. All right, so we decided to risk it. We have enough for probably one and a half cooks. And worst case scenario, we'll just ask someone if we can use their gas or their cooker or whatever. Boil some water for dinner. It should be okay. I don't know if you guys can see the plane up to the right there. I think we're coming around to a military base here. Check this out, guys. We found a few jets. Just at the entrance to one of the Air Force bases. We were saying we might even eat here. Yeah, there's shade. All we need is water. Yeah, so we just found ourselves in Missile Park. There is a beautiful bench too. See? But we can't find any water. Taylor's just going to go look over there. Yeah, it's definitely not what I was expecting to see out here. Hopefully, fingers crossed, Taylor has found water over there. This has been the road for a while now, guys. Could not ask for anything more. It's like, you know, a huge road and just empty. So good. And so we found ourselves back up on the coast. Got about five miles to the state park, Sycamore Canyon. And yeah, Santa Monica Mountains. I guess that's these. Hell yeah. Check it out guys, these mountains are actually pretty cool. Feels like desert. California, Southern California is definitely a desert. Just when you thought you'd like seen it all, you know, the West Coast just gets a bit more diverse. Damn, guys, how good is this? This is just epic. And it's so good that most of the traffic's obviously gone inland on the 101. So we've pretty much got this road, you know, mostly to ourselves, besides a bit of tourist and beach traffic. Isn't that beautiful riding? Pretty quiet. Sick shoulder. Let's check out the coast as well. Damn, man. We only got like two miles of this left to go. I'm just smashing a cliff bar. We made it, guys. Sycamore Canyon. The campground's on the left. So we're going to pop in, set up, and carb up. What an awesome day of riding. It has been great. So check it out. Looks like the hike and bike is up this trail. See a little water faucet on entry. Oh yeah, I can see something. I love it when the hiking bikes are away from all the people. It makes for a way nicer experience at these parks. And this was only five bucks each. Ooh, that's a bit soft. It's a bit soft, mate. <laughs> it's a bit soft, Taylor, just be careful. All right, so we made it down to the site and it's actually pretty nice. It's like away from the camps a little bit, although the family there is hella loud. You can probably hear them. We moved a table into the shade. We're going to set the tent up under the tree, make some lunch, and yeah, it should be a good spot. Although, mosquitoes. First up. Oh my god. First time we've had mosquitoes in a while. Alright, guys, so we have bailed into the tent because the mosquitoes were horrendous here. We're eating lunch in here. Do you want to show them what we're doing, Taylor? Yes. So we're making some burritos again, round two, because we had leftover tortillas. And we don't have lettuce this time, but we still have everything else. We've got lime, tomatoes, avocado, we've got salsa, and then refried beans this time, and rice. Ooh. So guys, we found this way through to the beach. Right. Kyle's just in there now. I'm not sure if you can actually get right through if the, like the tide is up too far. Let's go have a look. All right, so it looks like it is possible. <laughs> can't get through. <laughs> Good little shortcut actually guys. Right under the road. Yeah, so that's the campsite back there on the left. And check this out. 
pretty big contrast to back in Oregon. You know, it reminds us of a bit of Humbug. Humbug Mountain, except way drier. So, we're down the beach here at Sycamore Canyon, and yeah, it's super pretty. There's quite a few people down here. There's like picnic tables right up on the beach. I might go for a swim. Taylor's just having a look. We need to find a warm showers or maybe a hostel down in Santa Monica or Venice Beach for tomorrow. Crazy, isn't it crazy, guys? We're hitting LA tomorrow. It's like, if I feel like we were just north of San Francisco and now we're here. It's like so fast. Like the last state park that we're staying at before LA. Just crazy, just crazy. So hopefully she can find something and yeah, I'm gonna go for a swim. Yeah, and isn't this a sick spot? Road's kind of busy, I noticed. It wasn't busy earlier today, but maybe we'll try and leave a bit early in the morning. It might be quieter. There's Taylor. I dragged the table under the tree for some shade. <laughs> How is the water? It's pretty brisk, guys. It's definitely cold. It looks Colder cold. Than Santa Barbara area. Yeah. Come on, Taylor. No. <laughs> All right, so we bailed into the tent again, guys. The mosquitoes are horrendous. We had some showers. Uh, the shower water gets like lukewarm at best, and it's like a token. Now we're smashing some dinner. We've got some pasta cooked nice and al dente. It's really good. And after that, we're gonna chill, watch The Office, and then try and get an early night, because tomorrow, LA. All right, so we're finishing up. We're gonna get to bed. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Remember to hit subscribe so you catch tomorrow's video. Like I said before, heading into LA, crazy. We're gonna hit Santa Monica and Venice Beach as well. Should be pretty sick. If you've got any questions about today, just leave a comment. It's been a pretty good day. Chill day riding, beautiful day riding. And yeah, remember to hit thumbs up.